everyone and welcome back to my channel now excuse the background noise it's the weekend and i've got my little munchkin at home talking there you go um i was just about to do a an eye palette review and this package dropped through my door better cover up the address okay um and actually it's something that i've been wanting for quite some time and my son's coming to say hello to you there he is say hello jack all right um, it's been something I've been karate wanting for quite some kick. time. Karate. Okay, Jack, enough now. Thank you. Um, and so I decided to purchase it from a company that I've never purchased from before, which is this company that keeps popping up on my Facebook feed called Beauty and the Boutique. And actually, the, the thing that I was after was cheaper on their site than on the other site that I'd seen it in. So, um basically what i wanted to get so that this is how it's arrived i haven't even opened it yet i just think it's really sweet with love um it, it, they, it's just nice little touch um and it's basically the daniel sandler watercolor blush now i've got it in two colors both peach but one is a kind of um a, a matte colored peach and the other one is a more shimmery peach and i looked in here and they've sent this is really sweet Look, a packet of love hearts, and I know we'll be wanting those. Uh -huh. So, a packet of love hearts and a leaflet all about, um, let's see, what have we got here? Strike a pose on Instagram. How to wear your new purchase. I knew that my, my love hearts would go missing. They've already gone from my table. Just make sure you leave mummy one to try, Jack. Right, I hope and you won in a quarter. Oh, thank you. <laughs> so it tells you all about how to kind of use your new purchase. I I think that um, I, I've noticed this company. They're they're kind of they make an effort, you know, with their customer service. And you know, there are other companies that do that too. Um, and I'm not, you know, but I just think um, yeah, just sweet little touches, really. So let's get down to opening this um. This package, it's very well packaged actually. Now the reason I've been after this for a while is I have got very watery eyes and I find that powder blushes, I've got, I've got a fair few, not, not a massive amount of blushes I have to say, not compared to eye palettes. Oh thank you and he's given me the I love you one. Thank you Jack. So um, mm, now I won't be able to speak. Um, so I've got blushes, but I haven't got an awful lot. All my blushes that I've got are powder blushes. And I find that they kind of wear off throughout the day. And I always have to warm up my complexion. I've got one of these olive complexions. Foundations that make me often look pale. I look pale in the middle of the day. And I'm constantly sort of having to warm up my complexion. Now, what I like about these was that they said they're waterproof um, and they look very natural. So this is how they look in the package. And I ordered, let's see if the shades are... I ordered Gentle and Passion. Um, so as I said, Passion is the one that's shimmery and Gentle is the one that is more of a matte colour. So let's dig in. I probably should read her tutorial, but I'm I kind of got an idea how to put it on, so I'm just going to I'm just going to um jump into it really. Let's see if I can get it open. It's so well packaged here that it's one of those things that's quite difficult to get open. Right. Okay, so here is the gentle watercolor liquid blush, and I remember that they said you have to shake it. Shake it to wake it. Ah! Be careful, Jack. You shouldn't be on that in here, should you? Right, so this one is Gentle, which is the matte shade. And I'm just going to put a dollop on my hand. So that, I, and you can see there's a shade. It's very, very runny, which of course I expected it to be because it's called watercolour. And I'm just going to dab that on now, like that. And apparently it sets quite quickly, so you have to kind of work quite quickly. 
I thought what I'll do is I'll put this one on first and then I might put the passion one on slightly higher so that you can kind of see both effects. I like that. I like that because it just looks like I've got a bit of a flush to my cheeks and it doesn't look like I've got any makeup on. Can you see the difference? I think that's lovely. And these you can actually put on your lips as well. Um, I don't know whether I'm going to do that yet. So there, I, as you can see, is a swatch. And yet, as you see, it's very, very watery. And it kind of... But very pigmented as well. Um, a lot more pigmented than I'd expected. I've seen some similar products, like a Benefit. But they tend to be quite um, water, too watered down, I think. To actually show on my complexion so <clears throat> shall I put some let's let's dab it on the other side so that I can at least look balanced Jack darling yeah. that film's finished and you're not in here so could you get rid of that background noise for me sweetheart thank you thank you darling You're crawling? What are you doing that for? Because I like crawling. So there you go. I, I really like that. I think that's a really good... Obviously, I haven't tested the longevity of it yet. But we shall see throughout the day. Um, and I will <clears throat> let you know on my next video rather than doing um, ones that are linked up. Um, I just want to do kind of immediate videos today. Not ones that I have to do lots of editing. Because it is my weekend and I haven't been very well guys I've been on antibiotics and they are making me feel not very nice so <clears throat> this one I've just opened is passion and this is one that is marketed as looking a good color on anyone so um I will show you that one I've still got some of the gentle on my hands <clears throat> Excuse my makeup top, by the way. It's not that I wear dirty tops. I kind of, it's like my painting easel top. I put it on so that it protects my clothes. Um, now, let me let me do one dollop of passion. Now, it actually looks quite similar in colour to gentle, but it has got a shimmer running through it. I don't know if you can see that. It's quite difficult to pick it up. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put this slightly over the other one. Yeah, and I think once I rub it in, you can see it gives me a little bit more of a, of a sheen. Okay. And then I'm just going to do the other side. I definitely like that and I'm going to see obviously how much that lasts throughout the day. Um, <clears throat> now one of the things that you can do as I said is use this as a lipstick so I'm going to try this out. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put gentle on. That was passion, well done. I've just gone and put passion over gentle. Right, never mind, it, it's alright that one's dried down. So I'm going to put gentle on first onto my lips and then I'm going to put a dab of passion in the middle of my lips to kind of give that very subtle ombre effect so let's see what that looks like I like that too very natural looking and now Just letting that dry down a little bit. Then I'm just going to dab some passion in the middle. To give it more of a shimmer. Well, I'm very, very impressed. I actually think you could almost get away with putting these on your eye. But I'm not going to do that because I'm about to do um, an eyeshadow tutorial. Um, I think that they are really lovely. As I said, I will be back and I will tell you what I think about these in terms of how long they last because that was the reason that I bought them. But I think that they're very, very natural um, and I definitely would recommend 
these watercolor they've had some very good reviews in the press um, which is the, another reason I can see this bottle lasting me for years um, because of the amount that you need I mean I've put one or two drops and I've still got loads left over on my hand I could probably have done with <clears throat> using a lot less so <clears throat> unless you do what I nearly did which is drop it on the floor it did have the lid on though um, I can see this lasting for years probably shouldn't use it for years what does it say the life is it says six months okay well <clears throat> I will see I, I think that was going to last for at least a year um, before it starts to look like it's gone off but there you go all right um hope you've enjoyed my review and i will be back shortly to be doing an eyeshadow palette review um you're going to get a up lot of uploads this weekend all right take care um please like this video and subscribe to my channel and tell your friends okay take care bye bye